Hello, and welcome to Earning Their Stripes. I'm Thomas Watson, a senior government and history major for Midlothian, Virginia. And today, I'm joined by Keith Marks, a junior here on the golf team, coincidentally also from Midlothian, <laughs> Virginia, an economics and business major with a minor in leadership in the public interest. Keith, ready to earn your stripes? Yes, sir. All right, so to start it off for you today, who is your favorite professional athlete? I would say Justin Thomas. What about uh, your favorite food? It's hard. Uh, we're talking fast food or regular? Ooh, you can choose one of each if you want. I would gotta say a cookout, cookout quesadillas for uh, fast food. Oh yeah. And then um, probably just spaghetti for non-fast food. Chill. All right, so <laughs> if you had to recommend me a TV show, you know, what's your favorite TV show you'd recommend to me? So I don't really watch TV. I just really? watch a lot of sports. Yeah. Just big sports guy then? I don't, I don't watch TV. Moving on, what are some of your motivations to work hard? Really just try and be the best that I can be on the golf course. Um, I mean, it's nice to see your scores get lower. It's definitely, a f it's definitely a good feeling. It's really fun to see them go down. Call, yeah. text, or FaceTime? FaceTime. Definitely FaceTime guy. Definitely FaceTime. What is one of your proudest accomplishments? It's definitely a hard one. I mean, I would say getting an all academic team. I mean, I know my team knows I joke about that a lot, but same time it's really a great accomplishment to be able to play sport and keep your GPA above that requirement. So for the next one, what are some good words to describe yourself? That's a hard one too. I'd say confident, um, funny, outgoing. Yeah. All right. <laughs> so if the funny one brings up another question for you. Okay. On a scale of one to ten, how funny would you rate yourself? I would say I'm probably like a Nine or ten. Okay, so I, I think I'm pretty funny. At least, at least you you find your own humor funny. Yeah, I, I find my humor pretty funny. What are your friends saying? Same scale. I would say probably five. Oh, yeah. They don't think I'm as funny as I think I am. They're a little harsh, man. Exactly. Like they just don't get my sense of humor. But what is your favorite subject in school? It's hard. I would say business or math. Because much as I hate math, it's definitely satisfying to see you get the right answer. Especially oh, yeah. in like, stat. When you're not out there on the golf course, you know, where, what can we find you doing? What are some of your hobbies and interests? Usually just in my room vibing. I mean. <laughs> if you could be anybody or do anything for a day, who would you be or what would you do? You no, know, I would say Phil Mickelson. Ooh. I mean, I see his video series, you know, he hits bombs. He's like 50 years old, still hitting it at 340. Yep. You know, how, how could you not want to live his life for a day, you know? If you had to give me your favorite place here on campus, where are you going with? For academic, library, but for fun, I would probably just say my house. So, if you had to recommend me your favorite book, you know, what are you bringing to the table? I mean, I'm reading a golf book right now. Okay. Called uh, Putting Out of Your Mind by Bob Rotella. I'm like a quarter of the way through it, it's pretty good. Definitely helping me on the golf course. So, if I want to shave a couple of strokes off my short game, Definitely a book to read. I would, yeah. If you had to choose, you gotta pick one, beach or mountains? Beach. No hesitation. Yeah, big beach guy. Got one more for you. Who knows you best? I'd say probably, once again, my roommate. I mean, we've lived together for two years now. Known since freshman year. Do really everything together. Like we're always together. Always hanging out. Always hanging out. Watching TV, <laughs> yeah. going to the dining hall. Yep. Nice. So that was the last one I had for you today. Ladies and gentlemen, that has been Keith Marks and he has earned his stripes.